Welcome back to The Witcher 3 Blood and Wine. We are hunting down the Mandicore here. So let's see if we can find the cave with the hidden chapel. That should be interesting. We do know that hut here in the Caroberta woods. Even a horse drops if you ride it at a constant gallop. Yeah. That I guess that's true. Oh, sorry, kitty. There were no people before, I think, though. Or it's not the HUD, I meant. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, let's see how far we have to travel. Oh, far. Very far. Goodness gracious. No, that's, that's not a quest. Okay. In that case, I think we will use that fast travel opportunity into the palace gardens. Ho ho. Maybe we can even check out a few of these question marks. But let's first travel there. There. Oh, and it's, it is the last location. The other point here just says find all the diagrams. <laughs> okay, there is no other location. If we have been there, we have found them all. Oh gosh, it's night time now. <laughs> hey, so I think we sit in this beautiful little whatever that is and meditate a bit, shall we? So that we may see the hunter game. New quest. The Hunter game. Ah, Marlene! Oh, we can go back. Cool. Let's find that gear first, though. Should be pretty close. Man, that's beautiful. <laughs> I mean, it's the palace gardens, right? Would be sad if they wouldn't be beautiful. Oh, there we are. What are we dealing with? I mean, with the cave, yeah, entrance. Oh, these are the Gorgon foothills. Isn't there another quest? Close by? Uh oh. Nothing in the water. That's good. What's going on here? I think, is that an ore? When? Okay, good. Just like the great beggar described it, Chapel Merton visited must be in the cave. Let's grab that first. Okay. Do we need a cat? <coughs> oh. What? I cannot move. Oh no, Geralt? <coughs> oh, oh dang. Dad, uh, what's going on here? Yeah, what's going on there? Okay. So, thing is, it's everywhere here. Should I try and burn it? It's not flammable. And it doesn't hurt me. So most probably we will deal with 
Oh, now it's burning. I think. Probably we are dealing with a hallucination later on, right? Is that what's going on? Drugs? Yeah, it's not going away as far can I, as I can see. We're still, yeah. And there are these mushrooms everywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Murky Dell. Uh oh. If that is an actual young woman. <laughs> Nude women in a cave? Yeah. Something's not right. No. What does she say? Nothing. Okay. Let's talk to her, but be careful. Let's get a Gwen going. What could she be? A lot of things. A vampire. Mm. I mean, it's of no use to put something already on my... Oh, I didn't put them back in my chest. Oh, I forgot. Dang. Um, to put something already on my sword or drink something. I have no idea. Yeah, yeah, okay. Vampire, right? Yeah, Bruxa. Okay. Okay. Where is she? Oh, and I think she's not alone, right? Yeah, yeah, there are more, 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 more than one. So let's eat up and let's drink that. Where did she go? Oh, oh gosh. Let's F it. There. Okay. I think I'm going to drink a black blood if I have the time to do so. That's it. Right, you go. There. Now she should take damage from hurting us. <gasps> yeah, there we go. Yep, she does. <laughs> that scream. <laughs> she did. took damage as if they were real how can you take damage from a hallucination okay now I'm turned around maybe this is time for a cat white honey superior thunderbolt where's my cat at I'm not using it, it too often so I don't know we don't have it here right no, because I normally don't like it too much. Because my vision here gets distorted. But that's a bit better to orient myself. Is that where he came from? I think so, right? Yes, okay, that's the entrance. So we come up here. We fight the hallucinations of Bruxay. Back there is something. Through the wall. 
then we have the options to go up there and that seems to be a legit way or around here and they most probably meet each other those paths here we go up too yeah yeah what the there are people there beggars but there are hallucinations too right where would the other here that's where we would have come up if we had taken the other path yes okay cool now i know where i am beggars beggars here must be a test okay give alms i mean we took him Okay. Yeah, and they vanish. Uh-huh. Arms for the poor, sir. Interesting. It's funny that they give us money. Last one. Wonder what'll happen now. Nothing? The fire seems legit. Okay. Somebody put a lot of effort into protecting whatever lies within. But we're searching this chapel, so I think it'll open up if we act correct. That's not good. Oh, it's because I'm 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 intoxicated too much. I think that's why why I swing so weirdly, right? And I don't really heal up. Yeah, that's not good. Yeah, we're very slow. <laughs> Interesting. I think that never happened to me before. Because I normally don't drink so much potions. But they have poison themselves, don't they? So what I will do is... I will drink a... Um, it's that. A white honey. But then a cat again, so that we can see. Now we should be... Good. Yeah. Okay. Much better. Okay. The guy's gone. So we continue, I suppose. Aha. Uh -huh. That art dead. Another test. That looks a lot like Liviota. Impossible. 
Oh, okay. What's down there then? A pond. No, I cannot dive. It's murky. It's not deep. Okay. Did we take that already? Maybe. Well, then we go to Lebioda. Mystery man. Are you real? I mean, no, of course not. Not seeing visions anymore. Hope that's the end of that. We did well, it seems. <gasps> nice. Seventeen Spain in twelve hundred or three. It is done. I have reached the cave of tribulations and stepped into the hallowed confines of the hidden chapel. Never shall I forget what I have been through. I was attacked by giant fire-breathing creatures, power monstrosities akin to drowners crossed with andrege, men with the faces of wild animals. Yet Lebi Yehuda smiled on me and saw fit to let me survive this harrying gauntlet. At its end, here in the hidden, hidden chapel, I surrendered myself to meditation and immediately he filled my mind with a vision of a lake whose crystal clear water surrounded me, penetrated my soul and cleansed it of all wickedness and villainy. When I awoke, I was certain what Lebioda had designated as the last station on my pilgrimage, the Lake of Cleansing, where Lebioda healed the bodies and spirits of his followers. Following the advice of the sage known as the Great Beggar, in whose wisdom I passed at the temple of Lebioda, I pray all is well with him and the people of his village have understood he only speaks the truth and means them no harm. I shall now leave behind further things binding me to my former life. Doing so is not easy, however, for acquiring these diagrams once cost me a great deal of time, energy and sacrifice. But I know this is the right path. Let Lebioda accept my humble offering. Now I now continue onward towards the Lake of Cleansing, though my road is difficult and full of sacrifices. It grows ever more straight and clear, and I feel a lightness in my soul. My certainty I walk the right path grows strong as iron, firm as steel. Brace to Leviota. Merton went to the lakeside to seek final atonement. Should look into it. Ah, so there is another mm, place. I wonder if it's a relic of some sort. What is it? A skull. Hmm. Wonder if it's a relic of some sort. Huh. It's a cross. The treasure is never where the cross is. <laughs> it always is. <laughs> huh. But I cannot dig. But we found the treasure already. So we have to go to the Lake of Cleansing. Oh no, we have to go back. We cannot get out. Huh. Okay, cool. That was a nice quest line. These were real. Not the men, though, that we rescued. Um, wait, we came from there.
Okay. Lake of Cleansing. Where would that be? Oh gosh. Now we have to get rid of our cat first. <laughs> uh, let's drink another white honey. Whew, much better. Where is the Lake of Cleansing? That's all the way in the north. Oh, we've been there. Okay. So back we go to where we came from. <laughs> We're going back and forth. In that case, let's find our way back to the palace gardens. I mean, even if we find the last diagram, we cannot make it because I'm kind of broke and it's so expensive. Yeah, only 12,000. <laughs> kind of broke. <laughs> I mean, the last set here, that one costed more than 20, I think. I was over 30, right? So yeah, we cannot afford it, I suppose. Only if by chance we have all the materials for it, but I doubt it. Can I? If I... <gasps> oh no! Oh no! I wanted the peacock! Yeah. I did actually see the peacock. That's forbidden? Okay, sorry. <laughs> Let's go. They don't like my Xe in here. Where you rushing to? I'm rushing to the lake. Good this is such a cool village. I love it. Do we want to cut hairs? No, I doubt it. Potatoes. Now they even have sheep here. That is so cool. Because we liberated that place. And now it's full of life. Lake should be just behind that hill, right? Yes. Eavesdropping on people is so funny in that game. Not in real life. Will they fight me? I can talk to the bandits. No, they fight me. I hit hard too, don't I? Okay, X guy. Why men throw their lives away attacking an armed witcher? I'll never know. Yeah. Is something wrong with my face. <laughs> Everything's all right with Mike your face. Wrote about. Gotta be. Nice place. <laughs> hell. But it's funny that he comments on that. Exactly what I think all the time. What's that? Can you get inside it there? No. They had some loot here that they were arguing about. Nice. Does that break? No. Okay, 
I think we have to take a dive. Let's go! There's nothing here. What is that? Oh, some crowns. Oh, there's something here. What is that? Dang. Who threw all the stuff in the lake? Who does that? Golden plates. Let's breathe. We cannot use the golden blades if we drown here. Oh no! I'm carrying too much. That's a problem. A problem I haven't encountered lately. <laughs> but now here it is. Okay. Where was that thing? that another goblet I think let's breathe and see where we are ah let's go back real quick and Explore what we saw there. There. And then we can. Oh, first, I want to have that goblet. <laughs> and that ruby ring. And a prayer. Can I read it here or will I drown? It's a small. It's a. It's a quick one. Thanks be unto thee, great Libyoda, for thy help, for thy mercy, for thy warmness of heart. For it has allowed me to walk the path of redemption and atone for my sins. May thy name be praised for all eternity. Pagodar. Okay, we don't drown while reading. That's nice. <gasps> Here it is. Thirty second Fein in 1203. My road has reached its end. I, Merton, having been given as a child to members of the Manticore Guild of Witchers, having been subjected to their vile mutations and refashioned by their destructive regime of training, do this day cease to be a witcher. I have finished my pilgrimage and divested myself of all that tied me to my old life. I have journeyed to the hidden chapel in the cave of tribulations and survived. Today I am born anew, here in the lake of cleansing, I, have be I leave behind the last of the items which signify my attachment to my previous incarnation as a witcher. Along with them, I leave behind my cares, my grievances and my obligations. I cast off all that I was, including my name. From now on, I shall answer to Shovel. I am a new man. Thank you, most redoubtable, redoubtable Leviota. I feel my new self pushing me onward to new lands and places which remain hidden from me. The good folk who helped me during my journey always said I must listen to my inner voice and follow it, for it is through that inner voice that Leviota speaks to us. I shall not go against its will. I will set off north to the Maria, Edirne, perhaps even the Dragon Mountains. I will proclaim the glory of Leviota and do good deeds, just as the prophet com prophet commanded last stop. I mean the thing is he could have been a good witcher too like we are right he doesn't have to go all crazy on, on religious stuff so hmm But, obviously he wasn't a good witcher, and that is what saved him, kinda, so, yeah. Well, that's cool. But now we have a problem. Let's see... 
the Bessain farm is the next fast travel point and then we can travel directly into the city and get rid of our stuff. And I think we have to go home to put our gear in our chest. That's most probably what weighs us down. But thankfully we can still ride. Roach can carry us no matter how heavy we are, right? Faster. <laughs> But can Roach cross that village to the fast travel point? No, she can't. And that's why we fought so funny. Not because we were intoxicated, right? I didn't see. I think we were over encumbered the whole time, didn't we? And I just didn't see the chest up there. <laughs> oh gosh. But I'm not sure. Have to check my recording. Oh, now we are with the pigs. Think I'm coming down with a fever. Oh, there's a peasant reading. Dang, that's such such a cool village. Now I shall slay you, Kian. By my worthy work. <laughs> the kids okay where do we go I think yeah we do go into the city uh city there and as close to the to this armor as we can I think it's that or is it that let's go to the Metina gate and just walk down the main road that should be easiest yeah, let's stroll down. Hmm. And then the question is, do we follow the main quest or do we do another side quest? But let's first see what we can do with the manticore. I mean nothing, because I don't have it with me. I have to fetch it from home. Maybe I should have gone home first. Too late, too, too late now. But there is our oh. blacksmith of trust. Oh, and we can go down to the... Um, what's he called to collect our fees for doing some contracts? Every resident of our I'm back. Greetings. I hope your search goes well. Oh, it does. But uh, let me what sell my stuff. Offer? He should be so rich. He has all our money. <laughs> Though we don't need that. Squirrel steel sword. No, I don't think we keep it. To saw knight, we don't keep, and these we don't keep. Neither. That's my viper gauntlet. I keep those. This we don't, and this we don't. Okay. What's that? Nope. And we're good. That was what weighed us down. Or, I mean, that is what weighs us down. What else do we want to sell? Ah, right. That's pretty heavy, too. We could sell some of these to just to earn us some money. But, uh... Green gold ruby ring. I'm not sure if we ever would need those rubies and stuff. Notes. That's what we found in the lake, right? I mean, hmm. They are, are quite worth a bit. Not all of them, though. Let's see what we need for the Mandicore gear. Hmm. Mandicore, Mandicore. It would be Grandmaster. 
Why is it not here with the G? Enhanced feline. Mastercrafted Criven, Woven, Superior. Oh, weird. Did I miss it? Why doesn't it show? Wait, what, what am I missing here? <laughs> Do I have... Weird. Farewell. Good luck on the path. I'm missing something here, don't I? Huh. I'm a bit confused. Wow. And it's such a long time ago since I played the main game. Is the Manticore maybe a DLC thing? Can't afford a barber, let Let's alone see. My wares. I want to find out. Um, Kiss a dog's ass. Let's -a go. Not here. Ah! I want you to go home. We can go to the embassy. Go around here. Never you Get rid of the marker. Zonk. Okay. Okay. Home. Sweet home. No, it's up there. Here. Okay. Oh, right, Marlene. Oh, here she is. With fresh clothes and everything that are pretty dirty already. I do not know how I will ever repay you, Witcher. Don't expect to be paid. Hope you're feeling better, that's all. Oh, yes, I feel my strength returning thanks chiefly to Barnabas Basil's care. Horrible ordeal you endured. Glad I cut it short. Yes. Years of suffering. You know what's worse for us than the hunker? Watching my loved ones, my children grow old and die. All my family's long gone now. The last of my kin perished decades past. I fear I've nowhere to go. You, you can stay here. This is a big house, big estate. You can stay here. Truly? I could never infringe so on your hospitality. Yet, yeah. after all I've suffered, the years of starvation, I've but one dream. At last, to prepare food that fortifies, nourishes, to delight in the tastes and smells of spices, to sit at one table with others and eat. Hmm. Don't see a problem if that's your dream. You could help Barnabas Basil in the kitchen. Even his meals. You know he's not a culinary virtuoso. <laughs> Nothing could make me happier. <laughs> thank you. No, thank you. House could use a woman's touch. I've one other thing I'd like to tell you. Many years ago, my father assembled valuables for my diary. I never wept, so they remained unclaimed. These baubles are no use to me now. But to you, well... Perhaps let them be a token of my gratitude. If you wish to find them, you must go to my old home, to Trastamara. The dowry lies hidden in a barrel in the cellar. There are several barrels. You must give each a knock until you find the right one. Do just that. Thanks. Huh. 
I'd never expect someone with your past to feel drawn to the kitchen. Do you fear I will cook in your home as I brought as a wife? <laughs> Counting on you having slightly better taste as a human. Of that, you can be sure. I loved cooking, even as a child. My gran was a true master in the kitchen. Her spit-roasted oaks was famed throughout the land. Thought you were a lady, owned an estate. Do you mean to say a woman of my rank should have had a cook? You're right, of course. And I had the best of cooks. But I devised the dishes myself. They only prepared them. Hmm. You sure you don't feel lonely out here? I cannot say yet. Too little time has passed since you freed me of my thrall. But somehow, for now at least, I do not feel drawn to the city, to others. Visiting I understand others that. White. Yes, but ever at night, when all were asleep, I went in search of spoons. Remember, you can always change your mind. Decide you've lived here long enough, just say the word. I'd never wish to seem ungrateful. And I'd never want you to stay against your will. Ah. See you later. Take care, Witcher, and remember, you always have warm food awaiting your return. Great, thanks. Huh, we have a cook now. I can still track the quest. Oh, right, because uh, we can find the... her dowry. Awesome. Now, let's see. That's the Ur sign. Griffin. Yeah, we don't have a manticore. Did I hand, hunt down something that we don't that we never had? Uh, yeah, let's put those here. Actually, that's a good idea. So that's now the wiper, which is not upgraded because it came in upgraded already. There's no upgrade for that. That's my Geralt of Rivia stuff. Oh, that's the picture. And Wolven. Yeah, how did I think we had a manticore set? <laughs> Sir, we received a shipment of wine from the Belgard's vineyard, I believe, with kind regards from Madame yes, Matilda and the White Monsieur Wolf. Liam. I had the barrels unloaded and stored in the cellar to the right of the entrance. I'll Thanks. try one. Take a look when I have a moment. Oh, Spend. I have a moment. I was told to expect a subsequent delivery five days hence. Nice. Thanks. Gotta get back to my business now. See you soon. Man! The white wolf has arrived! Let's, uh... Oh, where can we put the swords, though? Should I... Weapon rack. I think there's... Space in there. Yes. Good. Good. Let's check... My trunk. Just to be sure. No wiper. Uh, no manticore has ever existed. But what am I going to do now? And it also didn't trigger the other manticore gear. Wolven, that's our, that we got that from a quest. Crossbows, no, there's nothing. We don't have a manticore gear. Oops, don't do that. Huh. Still don't have a trophy, no. Interesting. Maybe if we craft the basics? Or what we found is just like the Viper gear, that it doesn't have upgrades because it is a DLC thing. So it's only one stage and that's already like the upgraded ones. Where is the wine? The white wolf. Was that the white wolf? No. Maybe. I didn't read what we took. Oh, nice. We put a lot of stuff here. That's not the white wolf. Nope. Did we take it? A note. An empty one. Where did you put it? 
What am I stuck on? Oh. <laughs> no, not that. Uh-uh. <laughs> Wine and sex. That's funny. Not here either. Okay, I think you already took it. Maybe. White wolf. No. Is this? <gasps> we did. One bottle of it. How does it look? Can we look? No. It's 55 seconds effect duration. Oh no, I have it in here. No, that's not good. Can I just drink it? No. Oh, we can. We need to try it. We're drunken already. It's strong stuff. Dang. I would love to, I would have loved to drink it together with BB, but I don't think that's an option. Yeah. Strong stuff. Whoa. Stopping sensation <laughs> in my ribs. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Uh, we could go sleep, even though it's daytime, but then we get the buffs, right? Oh, it's over. <laughs> we sobered up pretty quickly. So, hmm. No, yeah, let's, let's sleep a bit. We don't get a food buff, now that we have a cook, but that's fine. Let's visit her in the kitchen. There she is. I thank you for letting me stay. I cannot remember when last I was this happy. That's the same, yeah. See you later. Take care, Witcher. And remember, you always have warm food awaiting your return. I do remember. Man! Now, if I now try to make the manticore basic set, I think... I will at least know if I missed up on something or which one was it that one or if I'm just confused <laughs> Our little Annie has a cavernous friend. Oh, another murder by the horrid beast Okay. Greetings. I hope your search goes well. Would you craft something for me? Of course. Let's do it. Manticore. Boots we can make. No problem. 802. Yeah, they are level 41, actually. So it's just a new set, which comes in with the Grandmaster, without saying it. Okay. <laughs> I think that caused the confusion.
Okay, we couldn't make Good it. Luck on the path. Awesome. Time to change gear. I think. Let's see. There it is, brand new. Manticore steel. And Manticore silver. Why do I have still have the Viper sword? <laughs> Didn't I? Oh, I changed it up. Okay. In, in, at home. Yeah, I like it. It's kind of similar to the Wolven gear. So means I really like it because the Wolven gear is one of my favorite ones. Cool. Nice. It looks pretty witchery. And it's uh, level 41 compared to... To this, it's better, yeah. Okay, cool, I do like that. Now, we don't have four colors in here. I think we already used, so we won't use that. Brown, it already is brown. So I don't think that would do much here. So yeah, we have to see what colors we get next. But that's it. Man, I like it, cool. And uh, thus, I end the episode. The mystery has been solved about the Manticore gear. <laughs> so it's just a new set for that DLC. Awesome. And uh, yeah, in the next one, we might do another side quest. Or I will do the main quest. I mean, we have so much cool stuff here. I would love to do that. Now that we got that, the Hunger Game, and that's most probably a very quick quest. Go there, get the chest, and get back. But uh, then there's also this, which I would like to do with not too much leveling up. And uh, this too. And the portrait! Oh yeah, I want to do the portrait. <laughs> I'm curious about that. And we can use to hang it in our house. Then Ursan Wolven and Griffin. We still have to do. Well, I want to do it. And yeah, at some point we progress in the main story. I just don't want to progress too fast. So that when we are through with the main quest, we still uh, then afterwards do all the side quests. That would be weird, right? I just want to kind of uh, even it out so that we, when we finish the main quest, we're kind of finished with the side quests too. But uh, we'll see. I mean, it's okay to do the side quests later on too, I guess. But uh, yeah, that's kind of the rough plan. And that's it for this episode. Uh, thank you so, so much for watching it. Have a wonderful and adventurous day and uh, goodbye.